We always strive for family-friendly content. However, our videos are not intended for and should not be viewed by children ages 13 and under. Thank you. Hey guys, welcome to Big Joe and Malia's World. Tonight we are in Bulls Gap, Tennessee at the Mennonite owned and operated bulk food and deli Yoder's Market. inside the door at Yoder's Market and I'm just going to walk you around here and show you some of the cool things they have. They have a book section. They have, look at this y'all, <laughs> jellies and jams, Mrs. Miller's homemade jams and jellies. There's a Big Joe in this corner. Yum. <laughs> Caramel corn. They do have all kinds of snacks and the prices are really good on these on these snacks as you can see oh yeah yoder's pies can't beat yoder's pies Ooh, looky there but they do have a big selection of pies as you can see and of course it's the bakery section it's got all their homemade breads they have some cool coffees that you can grind yourself Homemade candies. Peppermint fudge. Ooh, homemade candies. The whole section. Oh. What is wow. that? What is that? What is that? Pecan sandy cookies. Ooh, butter pecan cookies. Look at that. Peanut butter spreads. Look at this. Take you down some of these other aisles. These are some of the bulk candies that they've got. And trail mixes and things like that. Popcorns. This is cool. They have blue popcorn. They do. Check it out. They have cheeses. Here's the deli section where they have all the meats and cheeses. As you can see. Take you on around the corner here. Here's some more of their candy aisle. This is a great place. We love Yoder's. We certainly do. Toward the front of the store again, they do have a toy section. They've got all kinds of nostalgic toys. They've got Raggedy Ann and Andy. Look at that. Strawberry shortcake. All kinds of good stuff through here. There's a sock monkey. <laughs> they have some houseware items. All kinds of kitchen stuff. Cookie cutters, oh my goodness. Look at the selection of cookie cutters that they have. This place is great, y'all. This is really, this is really something that caught my eye. This is a whole gluten-free section, all gluten-free products. That is fantastic. Quite a selection. Now this aisle is probably going to be my favorite. This is where they've got all the cooking stuff that you would, anything you could think of. Anything you can think of. And it's all bulk, of course. They have panko breadcrumbs. They have um, all kinds of cornmeals and things like that. Um, they have cake mixes. Egg whites, dried egg whites. This is cool. Let's see what they got over here. Cookie. These are like different kinds of chocolate chips. Like this is a green mint chocolate chip. White cocoa butter drops. They have shredded coconuts. They have all kinds of flavorings. 
I love this aisle. I am probably going to be making some purchases in Yoder's tonight. They also have a section in here where you can try some of their cheese balls and stuff. And Big Joe is trying a Cheddar Bacon Ranch cheese ball. What do you think, honey? Y'all. Y'all. Is it good? Amazing. All right, guys. Mama Bear had to try it. Uh, uh, yes, she did. Delicious, ain't it? We gotta make this. Yes, we do. Oh my gosh. Absolutely have to make this. It's yes. delicious. Christina Varnum, if you are watching this, we found something that you would love. Peppermint fudge. Well, guys, we did make some purchases at Yoder's, and the first mm -hmm. thing we bought, I want to show you guys, is soap. Soap. It is um, handmade soap. It's um, handmade bar soap from Amish Farms, and it is the best soap. We have bought this before, and it's like $6, but you get five huge bars of it. It is the best soap to use, especially in the wintertime when your skin gets really dry and stuff, and we love the Amish soap. So, how many bought... bars of soap are? I mean, compared to my hand. They're huge. They're huge. Like, look at that. They're big. We love the Amish soap, but this is a repeat purchase. We have bought this before, but it's good. And of course, we were at the deli. We stopped by the deli and got our supper. We did. We're excited about their sandwiches they have there. They have really, really great food. Barbecue. What'd you get, honey? I got barbecue. Barbecue. I got turkey. I got turkey this on... This turkey got turkey. This turkey got turkey. I got turkey and Colby cheese on sourdough bread. Does that not look good? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It is so good. Their food is delicious here. Look at that. Look at that sandwich. Isn't that amazing? Mm. Got me a bag of those really, really good Doritos. <laughs> those <gasps> delicacy. Mm. Make you sing. Put me some Doritos in my lid. Their meats and cheeses are so fresh. They are. It is excellent food here. Mmm. Mmm. I know I told you in the intro, but Mennonites do own and run the Yoder's Market. Everything in here is handmade. It's handcrafted. I mean, they do have some things that aren't, like their toys and things like that, but all of their jams, jellies, dips... You know, things like that. They're, everything's handmade, hand-packaged. It is a fantastic and place And if someone to doesn't know what Mennonite means, it's pretty much Amish. But sort of use, Amish. But they use modern amenities. They do. They drive cars and they things like that. They drive cars and use electricity. And... and we love it. It's close to home. And we just love Yoder's. All right, guys. Another thing we bought... Little They're pies. fried pies. What kind did you get? I got blueberry. I got pecan. Look at that. Pecan pies. We gotta try them. Oh wow, look at that deliciousness. Look how thick that is. Yes. Look at that. Glazed. Glazed. Mmm. Mm. Mm. Oh my goodness. Mm. Oh my word. Put that up. Mm. Isn't that good? That is the best fried pie. Mm -hmm. You can tell that's not a manufactured mm -hmm. fried pie. That is somebody you handmade. You can tell that's that. handmade. That glaze on there is delicious. Is mm -hmm. phenomenal. That is a great fried pie. It is. And the bite I took was not just crust. No. It's filling. Oh, yeah. Good filling. Chocked full. So, guys, if you find yourself 
in Bulls Gap, Tennessee, make sure you stop by Yoder's Country Market and tell them Big Joe Malia sent you. And as always, we want to thank you for allowing a little bit of Big Joe Malia's world into your world. We'll see you soon, guys. Bye.